wear a mask, wash your hands, social distance. If you can't do that, I don't have much respect for it. Whether or not we like it, we're all in this together. We're all affected by this. Oh, look, it's pretty easy to do your part. If you, if you drive a car, you got to use your turn signal, not drive too fast and avoid pedestrians. Those are three things that should be pretty easy to do. And COVID-19, if we social distance, wear a mask and wash our hands, uh, we should, we'll be able to get along. So let's do that. Don't be divided. We don't need two wars. We have one against the virus. I think it's an image thing. And I, and I, and I think part of it, people still think, oh, you know, it's a bit of a retreat, uh, or I want to, I want to express my, 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 my freedoms or my independence. And I, and I think they're just looking at it the wrong way. Um, it should be a badge of honor right now about us uniting everyone. Do it. I'm protecting you. You protect me. If we protect ourselves, we protect each other, uh, the best way possible while we let science catch up. The mask is about letting science catch up. You know, it's really, it's been about help protect the people on the front line. Uh, don't let happen what happened in New York where there's two patients for every bed. We've got to buy time. A mask is a very good tool for that. And I have not heard any science that says it's not. So I don't even understand how there's a real argument right now about the wearing of a mask or not, uh, especially when you can spread asymptomatic symptoms and, 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 not even, and not even know it. You know, let, let's all of us together, we were united in the purpose. We are still united in the purpose to beat this virus. You felt it, we all felt it, especially in the last month, this little divide started to happen. And all of a sudden the narrative became, well, if you wanna to go to work, you must be on the far right. If you wanna stay at home, you must be on the far left. That created a false divide, that is not true. So that created two wars for us to be in. We have one against the virus, which is the one we're supposed to be in. The virus who doesn't give a damn who you voted for, or who you're gonna vote for. And it created the other war between us. And right now we're not gonna, we're not gonna beat this thing. We're not gonna let science catch up. We're not gonna beat this virus the way that we can if we're fighting each other. We don't have room for two wars right now. And I know it's an election year, but both parties, both sides could be more responsible with how they've used this virus for their own partisan political advantage. Bounty hunter Bobby Bandito, but you can call me Bobby B. I say it's high time we catch this killer, because we got more living to do. Here's how. So you lay down your favorite bandana, unfold it like so. Get your trusty coffee filter that you had on the go. Get your two rubber bands. Roll one down one end like this. Roll the other one down this end like that. Fold them over like so. Grab a hold, and you're good to go. Now remember, stay at home. But if you gotta go, strap it on like so. And right now, we're not gonna, we're not gonna beat this thing. We're not gonna let science catch up. We're not gonna beat this virus the way that we can if we're fighting each other. We don't have room for two wars right now. And I know it's an election year, but both parties, both sides could be more responsible with how they've used this virus for their own partisan political advantage.